German psychologist Ernest Kretschmer classified all human beings into certain biological types according to their physical structure. From his studies on mental patients, he found that certain body types are associated with particular types of mental disorders. He has classified personalities into four types. Number 1. Picnic type. Number 2. Leptosomatic type. Number 3. Athletic type. And number 4. Dysplastic type. Now we will try to understand these types one by one. Number 1 Picnic Type These are people who are short and round body. They will have personality traits of extroverts. Psychologically the picnic is sociable, jolly, easygoing, and good-natured. These people are more prone to suffer from a mental disorder called manic depressive psychosis. MD P Number 2 Leptosomatic type These people will have a slender or slim body They will have the personality traits of introverts Psychologically the leptosomatic is unsociable reserved shy sensitive and pessimistic These people are more prone to suffer from a serious mental disorder called schizophrenia Number 3 Athletic Type These people will have a strong body. They are more energetic and aggressive. They will be strong enough, determined, adventurous, and balanced. They are comparable with ambiverts. Psychologically the athletic is energetic, optimistic, and adjustable. They are more prone to suffer from MDP. And finally the number 4 dysplastic type. These people will have an unproportionate body and do not belong to any of the three types mentioned, add above. This disproportion is due to hormonal imbalancement. Their behavior and personality are also imbalanced. We already discussed Sheldon's theory in an earlier video. In that video. We saw that Sheldon divide personality into three types, which is also based on the physical structure of the person. So do you see any similarities between these two theory types? I gave you 10 seconds to think about it. Yes, in Sheldon's theory, which is called endomorphic, here it is called picnic. Similarly in Sheldon's theory, which is called mesomorphic and ectomorphic, here is called athletic and leptosomatic. So we can say that there is a lot of similarity between these two theories.